Hello and welcome back to the Musical Instrument Investigator. Today we are back on Gardner Hallgate Auctioneers based in the UK and we're going to look at day two of their guitar auction. So uh, this auction is finishing tomorrow, uh, start the 17th of June. It's the 16th today. Uh, it's starting from 10 a.m. Uh, there's 601 lots, which is absolutely insane, really. Like this auction is going to be going for probably at least 10 hours from 10 a.m. It's a bit over the top, really. Uh, and the um, buyer's premium is 26.4%, as always, kind of have a look at uh, all the terms and everything. So this auction is mainly guitars, guitar amps, pedals, and like a few other kind of accessories, pro audio kind of stuff. A whole load of items here. It really is quite crazy. Uh, so I think we're just going to crack on really and just go through it as quickly as possible um, and just take it from there. We're going to have to be brief really because it's just uh, a hell of a lot of items to cover and I, I do think this is getting to be uh, a bit extreme. I'm not sure what's happening with auctions at the moment but they're just trying to churn in so many items. I think it would be better to split it to more days but obviously it works more efficiently for them to do it this way so uh, without further ado uh, let's just go um, go through them and uh, see what's around um, so a Fender two-tone amp a Fender 68 custom deluxe reverb guitar amp a Fender Woody Jr guitar amp Fender Blues Jr guitar amp 2005 Marshall 1974X guitar amp a 2004 Marshall Acoustic Soloist uh, guitar amp, 2002 Marshall MG50 DFX guitar amp with an MG15 FX and a GA10, a 2004 Marshall Valve State 2000 AVT50 guitar amp, a PV Delta Blues guitar amp, AER Compact 60 Stroke 2 Twin Channel Acoustic guitar amp, a 1980s Roland Bolt 30 guitar amp, Yamaha TR THR5A guitar amp, a Marshall Code 100. H guitar amplifier head uh, 2010 Marshall 1960A 4x12 guitar cabinet uh, Hart uh, HD 150 1x15 bass guitar amp AER compact 60 stroke 2 uh, twin channel acoustic guitar amp Marshall MG100 HCFX guitar amplifier head uh, Laney A1 acoustic guitar amplifier PV Envoy 110 guitar amplifier um, and also a um, MA120 MK2 active wedge monitor speaker. Um, Fender Blues Junior guitar amplifier. Ooh, a 2020 Highwatt Custom 20 hand wired guitar amplifier head with a matching 2x12 cab. Mesa Boogie uh, Mark IV guitar amplifier head made in the USA. Um, matching 2x12. Um, some Goodman's Audium Amplifier Speakers with a ATC PA 75 12 inch PA bass speaker uh, 1962 Fender Tremolux Amp Guitar <coughs> Amp Guitar Amplifier Head and Matching 2x12 Speaker Cab uh, USA Voltage Recapped uh, 2017 JCM 2550 a model uh, 2525C Jubilee uh, Guitar Amplifier 2018 Supro Blues King 12 guitar amplifier 1972 Marshall JMP PA 20 guitar amplifier head with a matching 1x12 speaker cab uh, Fender Bassman 215 2x15 speaker cab PV410 TXF 4x10 guitar amplifier speaker cabinet Vox AC30 guitar amplifier for spares oh, This could be quite interesting uh, Fender Hot Rocks, Hot Rocks Hot Rod Deville 212 uh, slash 3 2 times 12 guitar amplifier high watt G200 RHD guitar amplifier head with a 4x12 cabinet uh, line 6 uh, Bogner Spider valve 112 guitar amplifier Fishman Loudbox mini guitar amplifier Roland AC33 chorus guitar amplifier Laney AH300 guitar amplifier Laney Richter RB4 bass guitar amplifier 2002 Marshall Valve State guitar amplifier Fender Concert Guitar Amplifier 1995 Fender Blues DeVille Guitar Amplifier 2003 Marshall 1922 2x12 Guitar Amplifier Cab Guitar Speaker Cab 4 Ashdown Blue Line 10 inch Guitar Amplifier Speakers A Diesel VH100W Guitar Amplifier Head 
uh, with the MIDI switcher. Watkins Wem PA100 amplifier with matching set of four 3 by 8 inch 24 uh, ohm speaker cabinets. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> Messy Boogie Revolver Accelerator Pedal. Uh, a Marshall GMP Major Plexi from 200 watt guitar amplifier head made in England circa 1969. That's a bit more interesting. How many pictures do we have uh, there? It's interesting. The amp powers up and following a 5 to 10 minutes run through appears to be working well. However, the lower input in channel is not working. There's a low hum coming from the amp whilst running. However, this cannot be heard while playing. Will electrical items sold as seen? That's the problem with valve amps. It can be, oh god, I've done something wrong there. Um, they can be quite uh, unpredictable, unfortunately, uh, and cause a lot of grief. I certainly always had trouble with my valve heads <clears throat> when I was playing a bit more. Uh, Fender Stage 112 SE guitar amplifier. 1990 Marshall 5203 Master Reverb 30 guitar amplifier, Craft FX 212 guitar amplifier, 96 Loudon uh, LD150 bass guitar amp with a Lania Richter RB1 bass guitar amplifier, 1970s Jetson Tremolo amp with a Sound City 30R guitar amplifier, 1991 Fender 85 guitar amp, uh, Trace Elliott C30 Speed Twin 1x12 guitar amplifier. Line 6 Flexi Tone 2 guitar amplifier with the Line 6 Flexi Tone 3 guitar amplifier in need of servicing. Londoner L100A guitar bass organ amplifier. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, An uh, IMG sta Stage Line GA1240 guitar amplifier with a Lean KN1210N multipurpose amplifier and a Hona HR30R guitar amplifier. Interesting. Fender 57 Bandmaster Reissue Guitar Amplifier Dallas Shaftesbury Model 519 Combo Guitar Amplifier Crate G40 CXL Guitar Amp a Custom uh, KGA65 uh, Guitar Amp A Fender 57 Deluxe Reissue Guitar Amp uh, 3 Smoky uh, Portable 1 Amp Amplifiers 1 Watt Amplifiers, they're quite cool uh, Orange Mini uh, crush, another orange wind crush, another orange wind crush, PV Valve King VK50 50 watt 1x12 guitar amp, 3 guitar amplifier speakers, Celestians and a Wharfdale, Ashdown Woodsman Parlor acoustic guitar amplifier, Roland CB60 bass guitar amplifier made in Japan, PV Valve King VK112 guitar amplifier, Fender Psychic Reverb 25 guitar amp with a Fender Psychic switcher, uh, Marshall Valve State VS30R guitar amplifier with a Marshall MG250 DFX guitar amplifier. Three amps for spares and repairs, Laney Tube Fusion TS200, Gorilla GB70 bass and a keyboard amplifier and GLX uh, B65 bass amplifier. Trainer TS10 guitar amplifier head with a Synchron Echo 50 watt amplifier uh, converted from a combo to head and a Rocktrek RK50R amplifier. Lady Linebacker 30 Reverb uh, Guitar Amplifier, PV Solo Series 112 Guitar Amplifier, uh, Hughes and Kettner uh, Attax AT Guitar Amplifier made in Germany, uh, 1988 Marshall Model 5203 Master Reverb 30 uh, Guitar Amplifier, 1992 Fender Jam Guitar Amplifier, uh, 1992 Fender Deluxe 85 Guitar Amplifier, 2012 Marshall DSL 158 Guitar Head. Uh, Ibanez TSA-15H Tube Screamer Guitar Head, a uh, load of tubes, um, autographed poster by Jim Marshall, London Sort of Rock from 2006, Ashdown Mag 300 Bass Amplifier Combo, a dust cover, Selma Little Giant Guitar Amplifier, um, 1995 Fender Blues DeVille 212 Guitar Amplifier made in the USA, Early 1960s Selma True Voice Bassmaster 50 guitar amplifier head made in England. Let's have a quick look at this. This is getting a bit more interesting. It's a problem. There's so many um, items in this uh, sale, but a lot of it is just not really all that interesting. It's definitely a case of quantity over quality, I think. You know, I'm sure that there are a lot of people because of the pandemic coming to them to want to sell things. I understand, but I think there's just too much in these auctions and it's just devaluing stuff by having too much. 
uh, Marshall G50R CD guitar amplifier, Vox Cambridge 30 Reverb Twin guitar amp, Vox Escort battery amp, 1980s Fender Champ 12 guitar amp, 1979 Marshall GMP Model 1992 Super Bass 100 Watt Mark II guitar amplifier, matching 2x15 bass speaker cabinet, Vox AC50 guitar amp head from 1968, that's quite nice. Uh, 1970s Vox AC30 guitar amplifier, a pair of Sims Watt 16 open common speaker cabinets, they're pretty cool. Uh, Vox AC30 guitar amplifier from 1964. Let's have a quick look at some of these pictures. This stuff is a bit more interesting. Uh, Big White Monkey BWM the Chimp Champ clone guitar amplifier. Um, pair of Watkins WM12 ohm column speakers, Fender Acousta Sonic 15 guitar amplifier, Ashton Engineering Model 115 300 watt 8 ohm 1x5 15 guitar amplifier speaker cabinet, uh, Lab Series L7 Model 309 AX guitar amplifier, 1994 uh, Fender 65 Deluxe Reverb Amp reissue, Vox BC 108 1x8 inch guitar amplifier speaker cab, New and boxed Fender 65 Deluxe Reverb Amp reissue. Uh, Vox BC 108, uh, 8 inch guitar amplifier speaker. Bad Cat Alley Cat uh, guitar amplifier. New and boxed Fender 68 Custom Deluxe Reverb Amp. Uh, new and boxed Vox uh, 1x12 guitar amplifier speaker cabinet. New and boxed Fender Pro Junior 3 guitar amplifier. New and box Fender Rumble Studio 40 guitar amplifier. So either someone collects stuff or probably most likely a shop that's gone under. Maybe that's why there's so many uh, lots in this auction. New and boxed uh, 8 inch guitar speaker cab. Another Vox 8 inch. Uh, new and boxed Vox M uh, V50 guitar amplifier pedal. New Fender Passport mini guitar amp. Various tubes. Uh, Rat Electronics uh, valve amp speaker load box. Orange OV4 tube uh, sync box, Bad Cat Unleash 100 watt guitar amplifier attenuator, Fender Twin amp, um, yeah, quite nice. Another 1973 Fender Twin, made in the USA. It's interesting. Uh, High watt custom uh, signature series. Not so many pictures on that, but uh, they do have a lot more description here, uh, so it's always good to have a look, but because there's so many items, we just have to go through. Uh, Vox Night Train, uh, NT158 guitar amplifier head, uh, whole loaded valves, tubes, whatever you want to call them, eminent speaker, another eminent speaker, Vox AC15 VR guitar amplifier, 1993 Marshall Model 4101, JCM900, 100 watt high gain dual reverb guitar amplifier, Behringer Ultra Tron. K900FX 50 watt keyboard amplifier with the Carlsberg Cobra uh, keyboard amp. Uh, 1975 Marshall 4x12 cab. Marshall column speaker with a Celestian speaker. That's quite interesting. Fender amplifier enclosure with grilled cloth. Uh, okay. Homemade 2x12 red Tolux. Fender amplifier enclosure. 1977 Marshall JMP Master Model 50 watt Mark II lead guitar amplifier head. Uh, 1993. JC55 Jazz Chorus Classic Jazz Chorus 1973 Fender Twin Reverb Guitar Amp Fox Concert 501 Guitar Amp White Horse amplica Amplification Bass Guitar uh, Behringer Ultra Bass um, 180 Watt Bass Head Selma Treble and Bass 50 MK2 Guitar Amplifier Head uh, Classic Selma Treble and Bass Very cool PB Classic 30 guitar amplifier, Black Star HD5, um, and an extension cabinet. Uh, 1998 Marshall 1936 JCM900 2x12 speaker cab. 2019 Marshall MG30FX guitar amplifier, Fender Lux 85 guitar amplifier, 96 Firehawk 1500 guitar amplifier, Phil Jones bass cub BG100 bass guitar amp, Air Pulse by Phil Jones uh, cub 2 AG150. Uh, Evans Custom Amplifiers Hybrid AH200 Guitar Amplifier Head Redstone Audio 200 Watt uh, 8 Ohm 1x12 Guitar Amplifier Torque T100 EB Bass Guitar Amplifier Made in 
England, these are like old school talk, haven't existed for a long, long time. I used to have a guitar version of this. Actually, I might still have it. It's probably at my parents. Um, interesting grill. Uh, I think Matamp bought a whole load of spare parts from them when they went under. This is a long, long time ago, though. They like the grills and stuff. Uh, a little bit of a fact for you there. Um, here is something a bit more modern. A Kemper Profile Amplifier. These are popular. Uh, I've kind of too old school i think for that i just like a simple valve amp but these are cool things um speaker simulator rack from palmer uh sequis mother load elemental combination dummy load speaker attenuator speaker emulator sounds complicated laney rb9 bass guitar amplifier head with an rb410 speaker cabinet trace elliott tramp guitar amplifier made in england a whole load of talk uh oh a talk guitar amplifier with two small practice amps nice old amplifier chassis with celestian uh black back speaker bird talisman guitar amplifier need of rebuilding 2010 marshall model 425a speaker cabinet without speakers sims what 2x12 guitar amplifier speaker cabinet sound lab and fane speakers pair of goodman's audium 15 inch speakers uh, 1970s celestian speakers uh pair of altec lansing guitar amplifier speakers uh, Peterson P200 8 ohm 1x5 speaker cabinet um, PVKB A60 keyboard acoustic guitar amplifier Fender Blues Deluxe Reissue guitar amplifier Vox AD30 VT guitar amplifier PVTKO 80 bass guitar amplifier Patrick Eggle Wave Modulator um, 1x12 guitar amp Gibson Goldtone GA15 guitar amplifier Music Man 110RD50 guitar amp Marshall Valve State ATV uh, guitar amp, Mesa Boogie Mark III guitar amp made in USA with flight case. Ooh, 2007 Marshall 1959 SLP Super Lead 100 Watt Mark II guitar amplifier. Purple Tolex, nice. Let's have a quick look at this. Nice, it looks quite in good condition. Quite bling. Yeah, quite like that. That's quite cool. Uh, 2008 Marshall 1960A 4x12. Uh, Vox AD120 VT guitar amp with Vox VC12 foot controller, Mesa Boogie single rectifier, Rectover 50 series, two guitar amplifier, made in the USA, uh, Marshall 1962 4x12 guitar amplifier cabinet, pair of Goodman Odium speakers, new unboxed hologram electronics, dream sequence programmable rhythm and octave guitar pedal, uh, new uh, death by audio micro harmonics transformer guitar pedal, uh, zoom multi effects pedal, Electro Harmonics Qtron Envelope Control Filter Guitar Pedal, uh, Catalan Bread uh, Bella Poc Tape Echo Guitar Pedal, JHS Pedal Spring Tank Reverb Guitar Pedal, uh, Maleco Heavy Industry Corporation Barker Bass Master Guitar Pedal, Thorpe FX Veteran Guitar Pedal, Germanium version, uh, Stirum, uh, oh, Strymon Flint Guitar Pedal. Eventide H9 Harmonized FX Processor, Electro Harmonics Pog uh, Polyphonic Octave Generator. I have this. Yes, I actually have. This is such a cool pedal. But with all the electronics, ha, electro harmonic stuff, they bring stuff out, and it's like massive voltage, like massive giant thing which takes up your whole pedal board, and then like literally three months later they release like the pog 2 or the whatever 2 and it's like a lot smaller has more controls has a lower voltage like all this stuff but anyway that is actually an awesome pedal very cool especially the sub octave bit but uh yeah that's a little bit of a rant for you uh, uh moog moogafuga murph model n uh mf 105 effects unit um very cool radial engineering x amp studio reamper guitar amplifier unit uh, Kern ATW1 tube uh, wire pedal, Digitech drum, strummable drum guitar pedal, Homebrew Electronics compressor retro guitar pedal, Electro Harmonics black finger compressor, uh, Wem Watkins uh, tape echo classic, Roland RE501 chorus echo unit made in Japan, Electro Harmonics Oceans 11 reverb guitar pedal, MXR phase 90 guitar pedal, MXR dyno uh, comp. Uh, Compressor guitar pedal, MXR distortion guitar pedal, MXR M300 reverb guitar pedal, MXR carbon copy bright guitar pedal, MXR micro amp guitar pedal, Tech 21 boost, uh, 
RVB guitar pedal, Tech 21 Boost DLA guitar pedal, Electro Harmonix Nano Big Muff guitar pedal, Ibanez AD9 analog delay, Ibanez uh, analog delay again, Ibanez TS808 Tube Screamer overdrive pedal, Electro Harmonix Ocean S11 again, Carl Martin Surf Trem guitar pedal, uh, TC Electronics Sky Surf Reverb guitar pedal with a um, digital delay pedal and an uh, analog delay pedal. Uh, all three with boxes TC Electronics T2 Reverb guitar pedal, TC Electronics Alter Ego Vintage Echo V2 guitar pedal, TC Electronic Flashback Delay and Looper pedal, TC Electronics Hall of Fame Reverb guitar pedal, Boss TR2 Tremolo guitar pedal, two Boss FS5U uh, foot switches, only ball volume, guitar, uh, volume pedal, Morley Pro Series uh, Wah volume silent switching. Uh, Boss FW3 uh, wire pedal, Boss FV100 volume pedal, a set of five Dan Electro guitar pedals. I remember these as a kid. I used to have some. They're quite, uh, quite quirky, literally as a as a kid. Uh, Dan Electro D1 Dan Echo guitar with a corn beef uh, pedal. Uh, Boss ME50 guitar multi effects, another ME50. Zoom A2 acoustics pedal with a Zoom RFX 300 digital reverb multi effects unit. Zoom acoustics creator AC3 guitar pedal. Boss RV6 reverb guitar pedal, classic. Uh, Zoom G3N multi effects guitar processor. Boss BE8 acoustic singer guitar vocal pedal. Uh, Digitech Trio band creator looper pedal. TC Electronic Force Field Compressor Guitar Pedal Digitech RP3 Guitar Signal Processor Untested MXR Microamp Guitar Pedal Ernie Ball Stereo Volume Pan Guitar Pedal uh, Exotic EP Booster Guitar Pedal Peterson Stomp Classic Strobo Tuner Guitar Pedal uh, Fishman Dual Paramatic DI Acoustics uh, Pedal Fox Model V847 Wawa In Need of Repair Tom Schultz Rockman X100 guitar uh, headphone amp, Ernie Ball volume pedal, another Ernie Ball volume pedal, Dunlop multi power supply, award session Gordon Giltrap uh, preamp, large custom pedal board with a Berkey flatliner power brick, Line 6 Pod XT, they're quite funny, uh, Tokai compressor guitar pedal, Tokai Z2 compressor guitar pedal. Trace Elliott Acoustic Dual Compressor Guitar Pedal, Boss ME50 Multi Effects, Electro Harmonix Holy Grail, Tech 21 Sans Amp, Electro Harmonix Big Muff Guitar Pedal Classic, uh, Keeley TS808 Mod Ibanez TS9 Tube Screamer, um, Jacques Meister Singer BB9 BBD, in fact, Analog Chorus Guitar Pedal, Digitech Artist Series Jimi Hendrix Guitar Pedal. Uh, more Dan Electro pedals, Marshall SV1 Super Vibe Course pedal with a Vibratrem pedal, Maplin uh, Echorda Echo Unit, uh, Hamida Audio Multi Tap 2 guitar pedal, uh, SKB Powered Guitar Pedal Board, Boss TU2 Chromatic Tuner, a classic, looks well used, MXR Limiter Guitar Pedal, Box of Papers, uh, Electro Harmonics Octave Multiplier Guitar Pedal, Boss PSM 5 power switch and master switch, Morley True bypass power wire guitar pedal, TC Electronics G system integrated effects. I remember when that first came out, I actually, always thought it looked pretty cool. Uh, Fishman Aura 16 Pro acoustic imaging pedal, pedal train classic uh, pro guitar pedal units, MXR Dyno Comp compressor, Zevex Fuzz Factory um, pedal. Full tone OCD overdrive guitar pedal, Wampler Velvet fuzz guitar pedal, Palmer pocket amp with a Tascam portable CD guitar trainer and Sub Zero Avalanche compressor pedal, Boss OD3 overdrive pedal, Maxon AD999 analog delay pedal, Mojo Hand FX uh, guitar pedal, Sans amp by Tech21 classic guitar pedal. Electro Harmonics Nano Memory Toy Analog uh, Guitar Delay with a Behringer Ultra DI. Uh, Digitech Trio Band Creator Guitar Pedal. Boss JS5 Jam Station Backing Machine. Two Wem Watkins Solid State Copy uh, Delay Machines for Repair. Free the Tone Quad Arrow Distortion Guitar Pedal. 
Arc effects big green guitar pedal, blackout effects musket guitar, musket guitar pedal, Frederick effects golden eagle guitar pedal, Zoom G1X guitar effects pedal with an Ibanez tone blaster guitar amplifier, radial tone bone tri mode guitar pedal, tone bone uh, radial plexi tube hot British distortion guitar pedal, BK Butler tube drive uh, real tube overdrive guitar pedal. Headway EB2 Shear Acoustic Equalizer Direct Blend Unit Zoom RFX 1000 Digital Reverb Multi Effects Unit uh, New Old Blood Noise Endeavors Haunt Guitar Pedal New uh, Old Blood Noise Endeavors Flat Light Guitar Pedal New Old Noise Endeavors Precision uh, Road Procession Guitar Pedal Even uh, Vox Clyde McCoy Crybaby Guitar Pedal with Tropical Fish Capacitors uh, new old blood noise endeavors reflector guitar pedal new old blood noise endeavors mon Monda green guitar pedal new fender tree verb guitar pedal new supro boost guitar pedal new supro fuzz guitar pedal new stone death warp drive guitar pedal new meris enzo guitar pedal uh, new meris hydra or uh, hedra guitar pedal uh, new meris preset switch guitar pedal New Hologram Electronics Infinite Jets Resynthesizer Guitar Pedal and Deck DMK100 Delay Machine. New Inboxed uh, Hologram Electronics Dream Sequence Programmable Rhythm and Octave Guitar Pedal. Pedal Train 2 Pedal Board. Uh, new Earthquake Devices Pyramids Guitar Pedal. I think a friend of mine had one of those at some stage. Uh, new Earthquake Devices uh, Hoof Reaper V2 Guitar Pedal. New Earthquake Devices Otherworldly Reverb Guitar Pedal. New Earthquake Devices, The Depths V2 Univibe Guitar Pedal. New Earthquake Devices, Nightwire V2 Guitar Pedal. New Earthquake Devices, Acapulco Gold Power Amp Distortion Guitar Pedal. New Earthquake Devices, Spiral V2 Modulator Delay Device uh, Guitar Pedal. X Demo Voodoo Lab Power uh, Block. New Voodoo Lab Power uh, uh, Block. New Walrus Audio 385 guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Iron Horse V2 guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Emissary guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Luminary guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Fathom guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio uh, Messner guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Voyager guitar pedal, Walrus Audio Warhorn guitar pedal, New Walrus Audio Kangra guitar pedal, New Death by Audio Interstellar Overdrive guitar pedal, New Red Rich uh, Famulus Distortion Overdrive Pedal, uh, New uh, Frederick FX King of Clone Guitar Pedal, um, New Frederick FX Do the Weasel Stomp Guitar Pedal, New Frederick FX Demon Fuzz Guitar Pedal, New Frederick FX ICBM78 Guitar Pedal, New Frederick FX Grumbly Wolf Guitar Pedal, uh, New Frederick FX Warp Sound Guitar Pedal, New GHS Pedals The Milk Man Guitar Pedal, uh, new GHS pedal Panther Cub V2 guitar pedal, new GHS pedal Emperor V2 guitar pedal, new GHS pedal Cheese Ball guitar pedal, new uh, GHS pedal uh, Muffy Letter guitar pedal, new GHS Morning Glory V4 guitar pedal, new GHS pedal Crown guitar pedal, new GHS pedal The Clover guitar, Clover guitar pedal, new Death by Audio Soundwave Breakdown guitar pedal, new GHS pedal Angry Charlie V3 guitar pedal, New GHS pedal Charlie Brown V4 guitar pedal, new GHS pedals Summing Amp guitar pedal, new uh, GHS pedals Tidewater Tremolo guitar pedal, new uh, GHS pedal Spring Tank Revo guitar pedal. Wow, a lot of this GHS stuff, a lot of new pedals. Something funny is going on here. Uh, 1980s Boss HM2 Heavy Metal guitar pedal, uh, MXR Dunlop Jim Hendrix System Fuzz guitar pedal, MXR Microamp guitar pedal. New Mbox Thorpey FX Camouflage Guitar Pedal, New um, GHS Lucky Cat Delay Guitar Pedal, New GHS Pedal Unicorn V2 Guitar Pedal, um, New GHS Pedal Haunting Mids Guitar Pedal, New KMA Audio Machines Dead Stag Fuzz Distortion Pedal, New KMA Audio Machines uh, Minos Germanium Fuzz Guitar Pedal, New uh, Rev GG4 Overdrive Distortion Guitar Pedal, New Sub Decay Variac Overdrive Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Mel 9 Tape uh, Replay Machine Guitar Pedal, uh, New Electro Harmonics Stereo Pulsar Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Nano Pog Guitar Pedal, 
New Electro Harmonic Soul Pog guitar pedal. New um, uh, Dan Driver Austin Pride guitar pedal. New Electro Harmonics Hog 2 foot controller guitar pedal. Uh, Dan Electro Fab Tone with Dan Electro Fab Echo. Guitar Tech Analog Delay, Korg CA30 Behringer. A heavy metal guitar pedal, a whole load of things there. New Electro Harmonics Super Ego Synth Engine Multi Effects Guitar Pedal. New Electro Harmonics Epitome Multi Effects Guitar Pedal. Uh, Orion DDS4 Digital Delay Sampler Pedal with a Rock Tech Chorus Guitar Pedal. Uh, Digitech Turbo Flange Stereo Flange Guitar Pedal together with a vintage uh, stylophone. New Unboxed Electro Harmonics Wiggler Guitar Pedal. New Electro Harmonics Good Vibes Modulator Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Holy Grail Plus Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics uh, Deluxe Electric Mistress Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Super Pulsar Stereo Tap uh, Tremolo Guitar Pedal, New Unbox Electro Harmonics Deluxe Memory Man 550TT Guitar Pedal, they're quite cool. New Electro Harmonic Stereo Electric Mistress Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Nano Holy Grail Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics, there you go, POG2 Polyphonic Octave Generator Guitar Pedal, and that's the one I was talking about earlier. New Electro Harmonics Holy Stain Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Mini uh, Bass Micro Synth Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Micro Synth Guitar Pedal, New Electro Harmonics Metal Muff with Top Boost Guitar Pedal. New Electro Harmonics B9 Organ Machine Guitar Pedal. Uh, new Voodoo Lab Tremolo Guitar Pedal. New Voodoo Lab Pro uh, Pro Proctavia Guitar Pedal. New uh, Fuzzrocious Demon Guitar Pedal with Second Drive Mode. Uh, new Fuzz Fuzzrocious Cattail Guitar Pedal. I'm getting confused now. New uh, Fuzzrocious grey stash guitar pedal new death by audio evil filter guitar pedal new death by audio supersonic fuzz gun guitar pedal oh look a mid 1970s telecaster ash guitar body fender uh redondo guitar neck circa 1969 alambic bass guitar bridge in these of assembly more uh, another alambic bass guitar bridge i'm pretty sure there's loads of these in the last gardener hall gate auction as well another alambic bass guitar bridge Another bass guitar bridge, Alambic, two old Alambic bass guitar bridges, Fender Guitar Soul, Heavy Duty Aluminium Flight Case, Hiscox Flight Case, Seymour Duncan Pickup, uh, different gold plated guitar parts, whole load of books, um, some more books, load of uh, scratch plates for Telecaster, etc., some other spares, whole load of cables, load of straps, uh, wireless guitar system, loads of stands and other gubbins, uh, loads of other accessory straps pair of old black bobbin humbucker guitar pickups probably for an old gibson 1970s gibson firebird uh, hard case uh, carlton fiberglass case cf martin case um Zamantis member magazines whole load of pickups scratch plates and parts other kind of books telly style guitar body uh, fender strat pickups single coil emg se5 guitar pickups epiphone John Lennon guitar pickup, Stag guitar case, old hard case, another guitar case, uh, shop rack units, stool, Gretsch stool, another Gretsch stool, Supro stool, uh, some Korg display sign stuff, uh, Hercules guitar stands, Roadrunner uh, foam case, Tele custom guitar body, um, two Tele style guitar necks, Swampash Tele, German carve. Uh, guitar build or code UK unfinished older telecaster body, sunburst finished older strap body, 1960s Hoffer and bass body, load of scratch plate, load of other parts, pickup rings, old unfinished 16 inch arch up guitar body with a frameless arch top uh, guitar in need of restoration, Fiesta red finished strap body, load of stands and stuff, 1980s Fender USA case, 1986 Fender American Standard telecaster electric guitar neck, Fender Stratocaster electric guitar neck USA 1979, uh, some kind of strings and other stuff more strings electronic parts stuff or no noise strings but electronic parts other stuff bridges stuff like that more pick guards uh, strap pickup assembly bare knuckles some other stuff another assembly 1970 strap bare neck bare knuckle pickups Seymour Duncan vintage broadcaster 
four single coil guitar pickups, probably Fender Stratocaster, Fender Pure Vintage Parts, 64 Telecaster pickup, Fender Telecaster Neck and Bridge pickup, set three Fender Custom Shop pickups, a uh, whole load of other kind of weird toolkit stuff, some guitar fret files, whole load of gig bags, uh, bare knuckles, mother's milk um, single calls, uh, very nice, very good. Uh, mixed selection of random stuff, looks like stands, some like keyboard things. Uh, 1960s Hoffman neck, Squire Telecaster neck, SX standard neck, 1960s Selma short scale electric guitar case, CF Martin case, uh, wireless guitar system, karatic tuner, etc. Songbooks, um, some guitar stands, some more songbooks, songbooks. A 1960s Framus floating pickup uh, guard set, that could be quite funny. Roland U20 RS PCM keyboard made in Japan. Yamaha mixer, uh, Boss rhythm drum machine, Yamaha uh, synth, uh, Simmons electronic drums, Digitac FX unit, Fostex model 80 reel to reel tape recorder, Hi Fi limited senior amplifier. Hammond organ, a uh, pair of Martin Logan uh, Vantage electrostatic speakers, Superflux condenser microphone, M Audio uh, interface, load of microphones, uh, nano keyboard, uh, MIDI controller, good cell reel to reel tape, uh, power amplifier, Soundcraft portable PA head, that's interesting, 1920s HMV wooden gramophone, horn and elbow from an HMV Monarch gramophone, that's curious. Mostly universal synth uh, system. Let's have a quick look at that. These kind of things are getting very valuable now. Uh, Line 6 Pod ST Pro guitar rack unit, Carlsbro Megabix mixer, Roland RD700X digital stay piano, compactor strobe control unit, Roland VK7 organ made in Japan, Samsung uh, PA speaker, another Samsung PA speaker, Samsung subwoofer, pair of Behringer PA speakers, Behringer speaker, Wharfdale uh, subwoofer, uh, Behringer reference studio monitor, KRK Rocket 5 power studio reference monitors, they're pretty good, Focusrite ISA 1 microphone amplifier uh, unit, Focusrite Voice Master Pro Rack unit, Tascam Digital Porter Studio, Roland MIDI controller, Behringer uh, mixer audio interface kind of thing, PV USB mixer, M audio interface, uh, Maki Onyx uh, interface, Line 6 tone interface, Ederol by Roland, 16 channel digital mixer, native instruments audio interface, uh, gear for music wireless system, uh, Boss BR600 digital recorder, uh, Boss BR800 digital recorder, Korg uh, clip drum kit mic or something like that. Uh, Behringer LTDI Phantom powered rack unit. Uh, Sontronics microphone complete with power supply. Shure Beta 58 vocal microphone. Shure Beta 87A microphone. Shure SM57 instrument microphone. Roland M3 microphone with Behringer microphone and a Samsung microphone. Rode NT2A microphone. Box set of Super Lux drum microphones. Uh, SE Electronics Reflection Filter, um, section of audio cables, other stuff, kind of chairs, stands, more stands, stuff like that. A uh, whole load of headphones, uh, speakers, cables, cases for stuff, uh, PA system, more PA system bits, PA system, Yamaha portable grand piano, uh, reference monitors from by Mackey. Um, PCI cards are getting very away from stuff. Another kind of mixing recorder thing, um, mixing recording console, sure, uh, microphones, Korg SB280 digital piano, uh, Vortexian amplifier mixer, Behringer uh, Sonic Exciter rack unit, audio interface there by uh, Phonic, uh, Roland Rhythm Composer drum machine, new. Auto Professional Zephyr Series Mixer, New Korg Prolog 8 Polyphonic Analog Synth, Roland uh, Rhythm Composer Drum Machine, New uh, MIDI Interface, Boss uh, Drum Machine, Ibanez Octave EQ Rack Unit, Yamaha Power Amplifier, Other Stand Stuff, Pair of Rock Systems PA Amplifiers, Tascam uh, Rack Unit, New Mark Mixing uh, Desk Preamp, 
Studio Master Session Audio Mixer, Tascam Interface Mixing Desk, Boss Rhythm Graphic Drum Machine, Pair of Tonoi Berkeley Audio Speakers, Pair of Celestian Tower Speakers, Pair of Dali Spectre 2 Reference Speakers, Ensonic uh, Wave Synth, Call Triton Extreme Music Workstation Sampler Keyboard, 1980s Chase Bit 1 Synthesizer, 1980s Sequentia Circuits Prophet 600 Synthesizer Keyboard, uh, Moog Mini Moog D Synth Keyboard with Original Operation Manual, uh, PA System, a uh, load of stuff there, Rode K2 Microphone, Rode NTG2 Microphone, Citronic Rack Mounted Power Amplifier, Behringer iNuke Power Amplifier, uh, Neve BCM10 2MK10 Channel Analog Mixing Console, that's uh, quite a thing. I was going to say this is uh, of note, quite a decent bit of kit, substantial. Roland Dimensions Chorus Rack Unit, Alexis Drum Machine, uh, Yamaha MT50 Multitrack Cassette Recorder, that's quite cool, old school. Uh, SR Technology uh, Subwoofer Speaker, Roland RD300 SX Digital Piano, Nord uh, C2D Organ, uh, Jupiter 50 Synth Keyboard, Lexion Effects Processor Unit, Spec Electronics Analog Mixer Rack Unit, uh, Speaker Microphone, or like a close microphone jig, loader stands, Sun Effects Redbox Audio Interface, Line 6 Echo, uh, Pro Studio Unit, Tascam D24 Studio Mixer with fitted flight case. And then the last one, Cork Triton Rack Synth Expandable. Uh, yeah, there we go. Well, we just kind of absolutely just crashed through that. Uh, because to be honest, there's just too much stuff, and I just think this is just uh, just too much to go through, uh, and also not that much exciting stuff, unfortunately. Uh, even in the amps, I would have. There's a few kind of nice things, a few gems here and there, but in general, not really much to um, write home about. To be honest, unfortunately, it's all a bit dull. It's like I said, it's all. Uh, quantity over quality but uh, anyway I'll put a link in the description if you're interested this stuff is going uh, up for auction tomorrow so check it out have a look at it there are some good things there for sure lots of really good pedals actually some potential good deals so yeah check it out and see what you think so once again apologies for speeding through it but really there's so many lots here I've just got to crack on uh, and uh, hopefully I shall uh, catch you all next time so uh, ciao for now Many thanks for tuning in to the Musical Instrument Investigator. I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, then please like, uh, subscribe and turn on notifications and watch out for the next video coming soon.